Another quick video today, DaVinci Resolve has just gotten a, a, another crazy update for iPad iOS. Uh, it's not really DaVinci itself, but if you actually update the general software of your iPad, and I'll show you guys really quickly. Okay, I'm on uh, version 26.0.1, so that's available to the public. If you do that to your iPad and then you go ahead and open up DaVinci Resolve, you'll actually see that I get a regular cursor, which I uh, you can change the look of the cursor in the accessibility. But if you go up to the top, you'll see that we literally have the exact same menu system uh, that we have in it in, on the regular Mac. So things like going ahead and saving your project, editing, timeline, clip, mark, view, playback. I also did a, another video earlier showing that you can unlock the other tabs of DaVinci Resolve, which is gonna be Fusion, Fairlight, whatever tabs that you want. I'll put that link in the description. But yeah, guys, we literally have the full menu system, including you know everything literally that's on the Mac, the file, the edit, the trim, the timeline, the clip, the mark, view, playback. So guys, we literally have the full DaVinci Resolve on the iPad, which is pretty crazy. So go ahead and get the update. Go ahead and add those tabs and enjoy DaVinci Resolve on the iPad. Peace out.